watching Papa Dank on YouTube. Hey everybody, welcome to Beyond the Barricade. I'm Papa Dank on YouTube. I'm Papa Dank, your host. I'm Brandon Cole. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is Valentina, our very special guest today. How are Hi, you? Hi, I'm good. How are you guys? Great. Welcome to Papa Dink on YouTube and Beyond the Barricade. Oh, I'm excited to be on. All right, all right. <laughs> First question. How did you start wrestling? Um, I started in three years ago and I always wanted to, but I was super scared to do it. Mm -hmm. And then randomly, like, I guess I went you know, like an early midlife crisis. I'm just gonna do it, and then I eventually started training. Welcome. All right, you ready? <laughs> Go ahead. I can't do that. What's that say? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on. I got it. <laughs> Is this it? Right, right. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's it. it says, who was your favorite wrestler? <laughs> um. So okay, I really loved Eddie Guerrero and Chris Jericho and the Hardy Boys. That was like I was obsessed with the Hardy Boys. I like wrote every time Jeff had new hair uh -huh. and I wanted it colored the same. My mom was totally like, no, you're not doing that. Like, okay, whatever. But those were my top favorites. Well, what do you think of them in separate, you know, the EW and WWE? You know? I mean, I think it's, I think Matt and Jeff kind of being separated does wonders for them as they've gotten older. You know what I mean? I feel like at one point when Matt was still with Jeff, everyone really loved Jeff, and then Matt had to like do the attitude and stuff like that, and it wasn't kind of as over as Jeff was at the time. So I think he's come into his own show. I think really awesome. What hobbies do you have outside of wrestling? Like, what do you like to do when you're still so active? Um, I like to play video games. Nice. What's your favorite game? <laughs> um, so I really love Far Cry. Uh, five because I know they're coming out with six which I'm really excited about but they like delayed it so many times since the pandemic so I'm like kind of nervous that it's never going to come out so okay. um, and I like to do like some singing of course all right um, what kind of singing uh, I listen to a lot of Paramore so I'll sing a lot of, <laughs> a lot of Paramore <laughs> all right good good so might that be another career singing oh I'm super shy with really I really don't like to show it off but I do it on my own and I'll show it off to some people but uh, yeah right. how do you feel being here at BPW I'm excited this is my first time being here um and I I really want to make an impact being here you know what I mean like this is the, you know it's my debut so I want to be sparkly and brand new <laughs> all right awesome who are you facing today? I think that's a secret. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Toughest match you've been in? Um, I've had a lot of matches that were kind of brutal. Um, I feel like, um, I don't know if, if Blackwater is still doing wrestling anymore. I think he retired, but we had kind of like a semi-hardcore match, and that was really like, because I don't like going through chairs and tables, but I did it. You know, I got to prove them. Would you go through glass? No. No. Not my thing. Not that much. No. Not my thing. No, 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 no. I. No. Glass hurts when you like. Yeah. Oh, I don't blame you either. I draw the line on glass too. Yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you looking at me for? You're not. All right, let me see. <laughs> so, well, your handwriting is atrocious. <laughs> oh, where do you see yourself in the future of wrestling? Um. So I feel like everyone's game plan, obviously, is to get signed, right? Okay. Um. I, if anyone says it's not, they're they're lying. You know what I mean? They're definitely lying. Um. I would like to get on. AEW, TNA, I've been an extra in WWE, I just, and I, and you know, WWE was like, hey, you want to be signed? I'm not going to say no, you yeah, know what I mean? Right. But I feel like maybe having the experience with TNA and, and AEW will probably, for right now, be better overall. Yeah. Okay, okay. yeah so. so wrestling's like long term. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good, good. <laughs> what did you do in WWE? Did they have you um, so remember No Way Jose? Yeah. I was on the combo. You were on the combo? <laughs> <laughs> nice, that's awesome. All right, where can everybody go follow you? 
Oh my god, I'm on Twitter. My name is kind of difficult, but it's Val underscore E N underscore Tina underscore. And it's the same on Instagram, but underscore with the V at the end. Okay. Yeah. And I see you on Facebook. That's yeah, why, I'm, that's on, why I yeah <laughs> I'm on Facebook as well. I don't know if you'll find Valentina Basket. That's a popular name. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's a popular name. I mean, if you find me, happy. <laughs> All right. What's next after VPW? Any other places you're going to go? I have a Lucha show next Saturday. I believe that one's in Camden, New Jersey. I love those Lucha shows. They're a lot of fun, you know, and I get to work a lot of international stars. So I get that experience as well, seeing how Lucha is. Because right. it's completely different to American wrestling. Right. So being oh, able yeah, to learn styles, yeah. how to work that, I think it's it's a lot of fun. And those shows I love. So I love that. Who's your favorite Lucha day? That's a good one. That's a good one, right? There's a lot of good ones. Yeah, there is. I might have to come back to you on that. That's yeah. a good question. That's a good question. Most Lucha people day. say Rey Mysterio. Yeah, but I mean, that's super obvious though, right? I'm going to say Penta. Yeah, Penta is great. <laughs> Penta is yeah, great. Penta is super great. Yeah. She really is. <laughs> hey, thank you for being on the show. Thank you for having me. All right. I uh, know Brandon was excited. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's a pretty excited dude. Yeah, he's a pretty excited dude. <laughs> <laughs> Can you give him some advice? He wants to be a wrestler. Yeah. Um, work hard, especially with training. Yeah. And don't let a lot of negativity get to you. Because that could definitely happen, um, especially when you're working really hard and you feel like, oh, like I, I deserve to be in a different position than I am. Sometimes it just takes a little bit to show people that you're, you deserve to be there. And don't ever let that like, hinder you. That's, that's good advice. Good advice. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that. That's really fun. Uh, <laughs> all right. Thank you for being on. Thank you for having me. We'll see you guys next time. Stay tuned. Papa Dank in the house, he is not quiet like a mouse. Oh!